Hi guys, so in this video I'm going to show you how you can quickly level up your athletic score. Uh, I'm at level, oh, well, all at 40, level 49, almost level 50, and uh, you can see that after hours of playing my athletic score is still at 10, with uh, 10 more levels to go. Uh, the way you get athletics experience is whenever you do physical activities and you deplete your stamina bar. So you see that uh, yellow stamina bar to the top left of the screen. Every time you perform actions to deplete that bar, you get athletics experience. Now it's it's better if you do this at lower levels when it's easier to deplete your stamina bar. Uh, what we're going to do is we're going to use Python, the programming language, to use one line of code to make your computer keep cl clicking your mouse in this in the center of your screen uh, until your stamina bar depletes. Now, if you turn that script on, you can just go AFK, you can go watch a movie, you can leave it on overnight, and you'll keep getting athletics XP while you're AFK. So I'm going to show you how to do that. Uh, so you go into your browser, just write Python, downloads, download Python 3.10. It's going to take a couple of seconds to download depending on uh, how fast your connection is. So once it's downloaded, just run the file and you get this uh, installation uh, window. Now uh, check add Python 3.10 to path and click install now. Yes. It's going to take a couple of seconds to install. So Python installed, so close. Next, what you want to do is go into Start Menu, type CMD to open the command prompt, and just type Python 3, and you can see whether it installed or not. Um, wait, so, yeah, with Windows, you have this annoying feature where it tries to install it. Uh, next, what you want to do is you need to install the PyAutoGY library for Python. Um, developed by Al Swigert of uh, Automate the Boring Stuff fame. So just type pip install by autogy. So that installs by autogy. Uh, so the normal location where it's in, uh, Python is installed is here. Uh, see users, whatever. And you can just go into that directory. And if you type Python 3, if you type Python, you'll get, you'll open this prompt here. So these three arrow, these three arrows means you're now in the Python IDE. What you want to do now is you want to get the position of your mouse. Uh, I have it saved here, so the command that you need to use to do that. So just position your mouse in the center of the screen. Type by auto g uh, auto g y dot position and open and close brackets. Uh, I don't know why that's not working. Uh, actually, yeah. Uh, um, you need to import by auto g y by auto g y. Now, when you type by auto g y dot position, open close brackets. It's going to show you the X and Y coordinates of where your mouse is right now. And you want it position in the center of the screen so that you you keep, when you're pressing, uh, the, clicking the mouse with your melee weapon, it's always pointing forward. So we see here that the center of the mouse um, for us has these X and Y coordinates. Um, I actually already have them saved for me in this command. So next you want to use this command, by autogy.click. What this does is this will simulate a mouse click at these coordinates, so at the center of the screen. Uh, you can specify how many clicks, how many times you want there to be a click. I've set it to 10,000, and you can specify the interval between each click. And um, I've set it to 0 0.4 milliseconds, which means that there will be a click every 
0 0.4 millisecond. This is going to get you about uh, an hour worth of clicking. So you can just type this in here. Uh, by auto gy dot click x is equal to one two six four y is equal to seven six three clicks is equal to ten thousand interval is equal to zero point four now when you run this you'll see that uh, your mouse is going to start clicking in this spot here Now we go back to the game, we get our melee weapon out, and it's going to start clicking automatically. Now, well, what you can also do if you want to break out of this is you can just press Ctrl C to keyboard interrupt and exit. Uh, what I've done is I've saved this, uh, this entire script in, in a file. So what I do is I simply uh, go into that file and if I run that file I can uh, I can just run the script without having to type that in every time so I have the file saved on my computer in a folder called autoclicker so if I run this file autoclicker.py it automatically starts to sti simulate the mouse clicks and if I go back now well uh, it keeps clicking so if you need to be quick to go back so now you see it keeps clicking automatically and you can just go AFK, you can leave this on for a while. Uh, if you So 10,000 clicks uh, is usually lasts for an hour or two. If you want to leave it on for longer or you want to leave it on overnight, just increase the number of clicks to from 10,000 to 100,000 or something. And if you want to break out of the program, just go back to uh, you can you have to be very quick to close it so just close all of the windows and uh, it stops clicking now if you go back it's yeah just the screen